Hello and welcome. Thank you for joining me in today's video. Now for the million dollar question. Do fairness creams really work? Now over the years, people have been made to believe that being fairer is the only way to be beautiful. And women have over the years felt less confident because of their skin color. Now let me tell you here that having a clear skin is very beautiful and skin color or being fairer really doesn't matter and thanks to the media that being fairer and being fairer is being more important than having a clear skin so now let's get a better understanding of fairness creams now most fairness creams do contain some amount of steroids now what are these steroids you can actually read it in those creams clobetasol clobetasone, mometasone, desonide. Now these are uh, harmful substances which are present in these creams and over long term use can damage your skin. Now these drugs have also been classified as Schedule H by the central government which means they cannot be sailed over the counter and you will need a proper doctor's prescription to use these medications. Now what do these steroids actually do to the skin? They can produce thinning of skin over long term use and if the skin becomes very thin, the underlying blood vessels can be seen. There will be redness because the skin blood vessels can also dilate. The skin can develop burning sensation to sunlight. There can be excessive uh, hair growth on the face by using these creams. It's called hypertrichosis. Then skin will lighten. This is actually a side effect. It's not a effect. The skin lightens. That's called steroid induced hypopigmentation. Then the skin will become more prone to get inf getting infections like fungal infections and bacterial infections. You can also develop acne by prolonged use of these steroids. So steroids must always be used under supervision and not for long term use. Now another important ingredient which is seen in fairness creams is hydroquinone. Now hydroquinone is an effective drug or an effective medication for reducing pigmentation. We dermatologists do use hydroquinone for treating pigmentation but if used unsupervised can lead to certain problems. There is something called as exogenous ochronosis that is pigmentation can happen because of using hydroquinone. Usually more than 2% of hydroquinone used more than 6 months you can develop this kind of a pigmentation and it is extremely difficult to treat this pigmentation. So it is mandatory to go through the products that you use especially in fairness creams that do they contain steroids do they contain hydroquinone what what are the other products uh, what are the other ingredients of these creams is very important before you start using a cream and these advertisements claiming that you become fairer in seven days in ten days it's not true you can never become fairer in such a short span of time if they do not contain these harmful ingredients I hope you have got your answers now that skin fairness creams really do not help much and if you want to really improve your skin texture please do see your dermatologist. So see you again in my next video.